Hello everyone, you're in Endurance Stage Lab. Today we're going to tell you about quick start of endurance make block engraving machine. So it looks like this. It's blue, uh, blue anodized aluminum shape with a uh, sizes 31 on 31 uh, on 39 centimeters. It's about um, 12 on 16 inch. So when you get this machine, make sure that all belts are pretty tight and uh, there are no mechanical and physical damages. You have main board, you have drivers that control stepper motors, each driver for each stepper motor. So make sure they uh, they are not that they do not smell as burned uh, board so as you can see the laser is installed here so this is a 2.1 watt laser it has no TTL so uh, now we will connect it and you plug it like a USB then you see the two lights are on and now we're going to put power on Okay, we use 3 amps power adapter and uh, you can see the lights are on here and now we can turn this system. So, okay, let's switch. Now all power, power on, motors, they get their power. Now we can work with a software. We recommend to use Bandbox software to control endurance make block engraving machine. It's open source, it has several languages including Russian and Chinese and of course English. So when you see it here, it says that it's not connected. Now Boris is going to press a button here and uh, connect it. Sometimes it's not working. Let's see what's wrong. Let's restart which he just did restart and now we'll see if we have here okay now we have com 16 right I cannot see it's com 3 okay I can see it from a camera now you can see that uh, it's moving so this is a basic thing you need to know so as soon as it's connected you can check it out and move into different directions like two drivers they control in two axes and the laser so the laser is connected down here as you can see uh, it's quite simple to connect but keep in mind you can only do it if the laser has an output not more than 3.5 watts so if it's more then you need an additional PC board we call it endurance M01 PC board that is needed to control the laser because this this power board this pc board actually does not support more powerful output so it requires external power for a laser okay but is let's turn the laser on this is a highest power show us the minimum power this is a minimum power you can see very very slight dot here it's pretty hard to see but you can you can follow it and let's measure voltage so it gives 0 0.5 volts on the output for the laser when we press a button on a maximum and you can see the laser is burning really powerful to what 2.1 watt laser and you see 11.12 volts of power that goes to our laser. Now you are ready to go and run the machine. The laser is installed here. Make sure that it's connected, uh, well connected. Let me shake it. You see it's, it's fixed. And uh, you have the software, Bandbox. You can download it from our website. Also, you can go on MakeBlock uh, website and then load it from there. So this is the late, latest version. Uh, about different parameters and how to run Bandbox software, we already made a guidance and more detailed video. So this video was supposed to show you like a brief overview how to deal with the endurance MakeBlock. So it's very simple, very easy to do. It's very uh, reliable. 
it is assembled so when you purchase from endurance it's already assembled and with installed laser and this is tested so we spent at about a day to test it and make sure it's working and you get an ultimate product so if you have any questions please ask us or share in comments and uh, we are always ready to help you and have a nice engraving bye bye